A port solar charger. What? A compact portable battery that charges your phone using solar energy. All you need to do is attach it to a window in the house, car, or plane with a special suction cup. You may check yourself how convenient it is. You may check yourself. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. A, a phone that is flexible. Manufacturers promise to release the device in the near future. Where is it then? Where my flexible phone? Oh, it's an actual thing. What world are we living in? Coming soon. The flexible phone is coming soon. This cat backpack for traveling. Cat backpack? Can I put a dog in there? Because I need a place to put Willy. And it's a backpack. You can put the cat in the backpack. I want to put a dog in the backpack. A dog backpack. Oh, there's actual backpacks for dogs. I don't know what occasion I would ever need to put Willy in a backpack, but I want to put him in a backpack. A cell phone and Bluetooth headset in one device. What is that? No, just no. Sorry, come on. You don't want to put your phone in your ears. It's a no from me, chief. An air-filled pillow that a hat I ordered online was shipped in. <laughs> Look at it all wrapped up. Hey, it's there to protect and attack to keep your hat. God damn it, Tanner intact, please, for the love of God, say the fucking word. Somebody think of a word for me. I can't think of all these, okay? I'm sorry. Too much brain capacity. Not enough brain capacity. A microwave with a built-in toaster. The future is now. Did you hear that, guys? The future. It's now. It's the future now. It's constantly the future. Wow, that hurt my brain a little bit. This one has a toaster inside the microwave. So you just chuck your toast in while you're, you know, heating up your spaghetti. Thousand IQ. Why Why don't I have this? I have a pretty modern apartment and it has some pretty futuristic sh Like, you know, heated tiles and towel racks. But not a microwave that can cook toast? I need to find somewhere else to live. Where can I purchase this? I need it in my life now. This inflatable garage protects vehicles from hail. So it's like, listen, not everyone has a place to park their car, especially here in Sydney. It is a rarity to have a place undercover to park your car. And this thing right here is just an inflatable bubble that you put over your car. I mean, I wouldn't put it over that car. No judgment to the cars. I'm not here to judge cars, but I'm just like, really? You trying to protect that? Really? I'm going to get bullied for saying that. I'm sorry. It's just not my type of car. I'm just, uh, I'm just going to stop because I'm teasing people's cars. Sometimes here in Australia, we have hail like this big. No word of lie. One time it rained here and the hail pieces were golf balls and tennis balls. So if that's going to hit your car, it's going to hurt it. This protects it. It protect, it attack, but mostly it is a bubble. I mean, I really hope that this is for hail because it does look like there is actually a blue sky. It's not just protecting from hail. It's protecting from everything. It's protecting it from life. It's like, surely you could just find a, a garage. Also, how do you drive it in? How does it work? This Portland airport bar has chilled tabletops for drinks. We are living in the future, people. Another thing that's like, why is this not everywhere you go? There is nothing worse than a warm beer. I mean, I don't drink beer, but there's nothing worse than a warm drink in general. But this, this is gonna keep it cool. I would wanna sit at the bar just to have that. And the alcoholic beverage, of course. The public toilets at this shopping center have an extra smaller toilet seat for little humans. Oh, you ever have that fear that a child's gonna drop in the toilet? Well, fear no more because this shopping center has you covered. That is really cute though. You could put them at your house if you've got kids. I don't have kids, but like, I mean, it's cute. It's a little baby toilet seat for the little baby humans. Pilot wireless headphone translators. That was a big mouthful. Pilot wireless headphone translators. As soon as you insert these tiny headphones into your ears, it starts automatic translation. I need this when I'm going to get my nails done because I tell you, they look at me, they speak another language and they giggle and I'm like, they're talking shit about me. What, what, is, what have I done. They're probably laughing at my gross hands. I, I know that they're fat and chubby. Like, it's just, what are you saying? Oh, it's for traveling to make it easier. Oh, I thought it was to, you know, find out what the um people at the nail salon are bitching about you. Cell phone with the clearest weather forecast. It's like, this is literally the shit that used to be in the movies. You were like, one day phones are going to look like this. It's like, where are they though? Where are the phones that look like that? They don't exist. They surely don't exist. Call mode. Like, no one wants to use this piece of equipment. Come on, guys. This is just ridiculous. When you blow your breath into it, it moves into handwriting mode you just like hold on i need to i need to use handwriting mode <laughs> This is meant to be cool inventions. I'm just disappointed at this point. A real-time bathroom display in Taipei that shows which stalls are free. Damn. Now this is the future. This is technology. I am sick and tired of not knowing what stalls are empty. Cause you gotta go through and then sometimes the door looks shut and it's not shut and somebody's like, oh, I'm somebody's in here. Please don't come in. This, you go straight to where you need to be. Why do we not have this all over the world? Like why? It's 2019. We should know better. I'm disappointed in our country. I'm disappointed in humanity. This chocolate bar is divided into unequal 
equal pieces. It's like sometimes you don't necessarily want one bite. You want you want a smaller bite or a bigger bite. This gives you the options. What if you're that person that always wants a quarter? And you're like, why are you giving me this shit? Don't waste my time. I want quarters. I want non-stop quarters. The size of the pieces don't matter when I'm going to eat the whole thing in one sitting. My dad has a cap with a solar-powered fan on it. What a fashion statement. What an absolute piece of art. It's a piece of art. We all need it. It's like one of the ugliest things I've ever seen. But when you're working out in the sun, it's hot. There's no airflow. This is perfect. And you don't even need to power it because it's got solar power. A hat has solar power and most people in the world don't. This keypad randomizes number every time so no one can figure out the password from your hand movements. Would I do that on my phone? Because you know, so many people are trying to get in on my phone that I don't want them to learn my uh, my code, you know? On my phone, my code is like six numbers long. Random tenki. Tenki. Sorry, my brain's not working. Hello? This hotel's mirror tells the weather. Of course it's on rain. <laughs> How sad. You walk out, you're like, ah, I'm on holidays. I can't wait to get outside. We're going to go be a tourist. We're going to go walk and we're going to see, see the town, see the city. And it's like, it's raining. Oh, well, I'm going to go back to the hotel room, um, order some room service, watch some TV and uh, sleep. My hotel room had a white noise machine installed in the wall. Hilton presents Logi Sun. Logi Sun. Sound masking technology providing a soothing background sound that increases the comfort of your room. I don't really like white noise. Am I the only person that just likes silence? Like, I just want it to be silent and dark. I don't want TV. I want light. I just want to be pitch black and completely silent. But listen, I would give it a crack just because it's there. You know what I mean? Like that's cool for people that like white noise. Wow. Technology is just amazing. Reusable, resealable cans at my local shop in the UK. What do you fill it up with? Water? Alcohol? Huh? I'm so confused. Do you take it back to the shop and they do it or do you do it? Do you fill your own bottle up? What's going on? But don't worry because they're reusable. They're resealable. That we are living in the future. There actually is a concept of a knife that could be heated enough to toast a slice of bread. You could take this time-saving, easy to clean gadget anywhere and not spend a ton on toast in hotels. I'm really breaking the bank by all this toast I've been getting at the hotels. It would be really cool if it looked like this lightsaber. <laughs> it's slightly more boring. Oh, so you rest it on there. Okay, that looks way cooler. That looks lame. I'm sorry, but but guys, don't worry because think about all the money you will save on toast because like think about all the toast that you get at hotels. You don't have to worry about that anymore. I'm just in shock. I'm just in absolute shock. On that note, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Make sure you give it a huge thumbs up and uh, I'm confusion. <laughs>